Yo, yo, everybody, welcome back to another Let's Build a Corner. This time it will be a quick one because last time it was two parts, fucking long as fuck, dude. And I don't have the fucking power to do that one again. Although I actually was having fun with that one. Whatever. Fucking, uh, today we are going to be using SLR Light Edition. N not like uh, SLR by keyboard smashing is an art. A uh, old school subscriber viewer of uh, of this channel, much love, my guy, and we're going to be using this mod back today. So let's go and do the fucking thing. So, so vehicle, uh, as we all know already by the title, is going to be a Volga. This one, this video, this video, uh, this build is going out. This, this, I'm making this, uh, this, I'm making this build for all my my Eastern European viewers, my guys. This is for all of you guys, when you know that's a fucking vulgar dude. Back in the communist days, for all of the non-communist people, uh, having a vulgar back in the day means you, 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 you were somebody, dude. KGB, no, fuck that shit. You were some fucking body, dude. You were somebody important, okay? Uh, and so we're going to be doing this, but of course it's going to be with a special engine. It's going to be with something cooler. Uh, then whatever the fuck they these come. Uh, w w I think they came. Now there was I was at this demolition derby thing uh, last week, and uh, one of the dudes uh, pulled up with a Volga to crash, you know. And that Volga had a would have yes had a V8. Yes, exactly. It had a V8. Uh, although I don't know this. Yeah, this is a Chrysler V8, but that thing had a V8 from a fucking uh, UAZ some shit, dude. Okay, it was it was ridiculous, mad, but. Yeah, so there we go. This is the car. Honestly, it looks fucking sick, but we're going to make it fucking destructionally epic. I don't even know what the fuck that means. Can't, holy shit. Let's just jump right into it with suspension. So we have Mr. Sir 2s all around. Second generation Mr. Sir's all around the car. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. Well, I've gone for a different kind of uh, different kind of call over. I've never used this one. There's the Skunk 2 Pro C callovers uh, which <laughs> ignore that that's slr things uh which honestly this car will be nothing you know it won't be track built it, this is just a fucking cool car so we don't need something too extravagant uh same goes with the spring skunk c 6.5 inches now for the brakes this car will have a lot of power we've got 358 endless discs on the front and uh i'm mixing and matching here a bit but you know it's okay we got 278 millimeters Brembo's on the back with six spot on the front, six spot endless uh, calipers, and six spot Brembo calipers on the back. Ah, uh, that did not go. Where the fuck did they? Okay, that's the Brembo. Let me just put it in the back, and the endless is on the front. Just fucking scroll to the other side. Thank you, fucking game. Then uh, that's the endless. No, that's the endless as well. So let me just install the endless here. Take the other Brembo that was that's on here. And then solve it. Nah, fucking. This game, man. This game, man. This game is fucking epic, dude. This is literally what I've been dreaming to do my whole day. You know, that's this is what I wanted to do. Fucking, uh, fucking with this shit. So let's just install these. These are placeholder rims. We don't fucking. Oh man, it already looks fucking good. Uh, these are not going to be the final rims. We don't know if they're going to be the final rims. Uh, that will become. That will come later. So uh, let's go on to the engine. Now to the engine. Let's see. Uh, we come with this V8 that making. It's making, fucking. It's making 461 horsepower. IRL is probably made like 70 horsepower out of this V8. If even it had a V8, I don't fucking know. But we're going to say goodbye to this, and we're going to go hello to the oh, fucking hell. So after uh, an SLR editor, the, the 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 car was not named Volga. So I don't know what the fuck or gas or anything. I don't know. I fucking changed a bunch of things and hoped for the best, and here we are. It worked, I'm happy with that, because it could have fucking been a problem. So we have two options for the TRD Epic Tuned one. Yeah, I'm going to go with this one, because it's cooler. We, we don't care about power, although it's like a thousand horsepower or some shit. Yeah, I don't I don't want a thousand horsepower. <laughs> but it, you know, it doesn't matter. It, it, it doesn't matter. Okay, can I lower the turbine? Yeah, I don't. It's not going to fucking help. We're going to make a lot of power, so it doesn't matter, I'm just going for the cool factor. Oh, my God, I, would, I don't even want to click on that. I'm just going for the cool factor, how it looks and how it fucking, you know, all, the, all that shit. Because, you know, it looks pretty cool right now, if you ask me. It looks pretty fucking sick with the fucking coolers and shit. Yes, 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 very nice. Very no, no, nice. Obviously, we're going to be fucking with the position a bit later now. Let's go on to, uh, I don't know what's next at this point. I'm guessing body? Yeah, probably body. Honestly, this will be where a, a big part of the fucking 
build will be like, look at how many fucking parts there are, holy shit dude, there's a lot of fucking parts, so we have louvers, which I really like, it's gonna actually have a fucking a nice looking uh, rear end, honestly, it looks like sporty and shit, so, two types of louvers, now I'm gonna go with the other one, yeah, louvers, man, holy shit, yeah, that's pretty good, we also have uh, fenders, rear right fender type 1, this is a rear right rocket bunny, a rear right fender type 2, so if we go and check out the rocket bunny, we can go with a rocket bunny build, or a, uh, I guess I'm going to keep that there, I'm going to be keeping a look on these things, so, fly swatter, what is, oh, it's these things, alright, yeah, 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 uh, nah, so, we can install the fly swatters, because, <laughs> I don't know, this is like a wild build, you know, this is like fucking crazy shit, rear left type 2, so this is the type 2, this is the rocket bunny, I'm going to make one side of the car rocket bunny, the other side, uh, type 2, so, so we know what the fuck's what, so, I've got also cooler, little, tiny, the tiny little, uh, things, um, Rocky Bunny side skirt. This is a right or on the left. What is this? What are these panels? I don't understand. What do these panels do? What are these? What are they supposed to go? Let me just remove the. No, not the car, but the engine. The fuck did I just remove? Lice, uh, place for license plate. Okay, these are the grill parts. These are the lights. Interesting, interesting. Uh, I don't know what these are. Right air lock intake, I don't even know. So this is a rocket bunny. Oh shit, I just removed the whole fucking fender, that was not what I wanted to do. So we should be able to install the rocket bunny. Is that the rocket bunny? That doesn't look very rocket bunny-ish. Okay, whatever. Fucking whatever. These, I can't install these, I don't know what these. Custom second part of grill. Hitch, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yes, epic hitch, man, epic hitch game. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit, dude. Right front fender type two. Yeah, the white fender is interesting, interesting. And uh, rocket bunny right front fender. How do I need to remove the whole fender for the rocket bunny? Oh, it's a right. No, no, no. What is a clear versus non-clear? Oh, it removes fucking things. Interesting. But it's still not white body, so... Uh, let's throw the normal one on and install the... Okay, I guess. The flying slaughter, of course. Front left... Um, front left fender, the rocket bunny fender. And... Rocket bunny rear diffuser. <laughs> rear diffuser. Oh my god, that looks ridiculous. I don't know, a Rocket Bunny. I've never been too big of a fan of, of Rocket Bunny shit. I don't know, man. I've never been a bit too big of a fan of that shit. Um, front diffuser. Yeah, but the diffuser is cool. The diffuser definitely is uh, is something. Uh, racing front quarter panel. What do you mean, racing front quarter panel? Like, what is this? Holy shit, dude. Um... Honestly, I'm gonna fucking look at these things by myself because this, this will be ridiculous to watch. Okay, so I've given up on the rocket bunny shit because it's ugly. Now the question is, do I keep it, you know, stock bunny or do I add the little fender? So the way we will see that is to just move the offset. Okay. Okay. Well, it's not gonna work with offset. It seems um, we need we need even more spacing to uh, fill those fenders up. So uh, let's add a nice big big spent oh yeah you know when it fills the so mm. fucking offsets dude offset is shit never use offset it's always better to use uh, to use the yeah because offset yeah, I'm gonna lo use the little fenders man I'm gonna use the little fenders uh, I like them type 2 we are using the type 2s, yes, and on the rear end we need another type 2. And we have... What about type 1s now? 
what about type 1? What is it? We, it's like I'm talking about diabetes, man. Diabetes. It's like I'm talking about diabetes, man. Because they're still there, but like not so big. Alright, I'm gonna f I'm gonna fix the suspension. I'm gonna choose them. So in this position, I really like how this looks. I really like how it looks on the front, but the rear end, I really need to have like a lot of camber to fucking fit in that fender. I I've raised the rear end to the max. I've raised it, but if you look on the other side with the smaller fenders, looks nice too. Looks nice, and um, I'm gonna push this out a bit a bit more, I guess. But it looks really nice on the. Mm, I really like how it looks on the front with these ones, but the rear end, I don't know, I don't know what I'm going to do, man. So, I have found the solution. I'm going to use the bigger Type 2s on the front, because I really like how, how they look. And I'm going to use the smaller ones on the back, because they, that, that's the only way they fit. Now, the question is, which kind of uh, side skirts do I use? Do I use these? The Rocky Bunnies? Or do I use the little strip? Nah. I'm going to use the Rocky Bunnies, I think, because it's, it's uh, a bit more... It's a bit more something, you know, it's a bit more something. Alright, man, this car is definitely taking shape. Uh, I don't know about the rear end, though. I definitely don't know about the rear end. Ooh, I don't know about the rear end. So I am uh, in a predicament. The way you use this rally, quote-unquote, uh, yeah, a fucking uh, grill. Hey, oh, these actually stay. Do I use the rally? I just used it. Nah, I like this one. It's just kind of cooler. I just like that I could use like four four uh, lights, and I was thinking of using like different colored lights, but these actually don't look as good as I imagined they would. So um, we are will continue as uh, we were. I don't, I don't fucking know what. It, oh, there it is. But I I will install these little visors. These little visors are pretty fucking cool, honestly. Little little, little fucking tiny visor on the on the on the, on the thing. Um, yes, honestly, I'm liking this. I'm genuinely liking this. It looks like fucking. It looks such like such a ridiculous car. Also, notice this. Notice this. That's pretty fucking lit, if you ask me. Um, oh, I've missed one visor over here. All right, so um, we are actually very close to the end right now. We are actually very very close to the end. So this is the final time you look at this car. Next cut. This car will... Okay, these are too small. These mud flaps. These mud flaps are way too small for uh, what, have, what, have you gone, uh, what we've done here. Um, it's got that BMW look where it's low on the front, but that's okay. It's fucking fine. Um, this is the last time you see this car like this because next cut, I will be out. This, this build will have been finished. So get ready for the little tiny little showcase I'm going to do. <laughs> Ignore the rest of the car. It's still not finished, but... I did not notice this. I did not fucking notice this little tiny fucking pipey little shit, dude. Holy shit, I did not notice that, and I fucking love it. Look at this exhaust, my guy. Without further ado, guys, let me just, let me just, let me show you this most beautiful KGB machine, okay? This is, this is what the real fucking pimp KGBs used back in the day. Look at this thing. Look at this. I'm, I'm keeping these, oh shit, the rims. And then it seems I really just like how these look. I just tried a bunch of different ones, but whatever. Welcome to the reveal of the KGB 2JZ Volga. Look at this thing. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, dude. No plates because we don't need plates because we're KGB. Um, we've got the tow hitch, of course. We've got the fucking mad big exhaust just to the side somewhere. We've got the louvers. we got, you know, we got the chrome and... I mean, this simulates chrome, because we don't have chrome for that, but with the chrome and black, this is fucking money. Look at the little fucking things here. Interior, we have a wood trim, gnarly style um, steering wheel with the white Recaros, white black Recaros to match the, the exterior. We've got the Zoo Jay-Z with a bit of pink in there for, uh, for just for contrast to be weird to be fucking out there because we are KGB after all we can do things be other people can't um, we got the intercooler straight out there we got the fucking oil cooler we have everything out there visible including the engine bay we got the big brakes we got the little Volga it says Volga on the side it says it's, it's nice you know we got badges on the back as well you know just little little things little things here and there this thing this thing is fucking 
lit looking as fuck, dude. I love this car. I love how it looks, dude. It's so fucking. It's just so extra, dude. This this is literally extra as fuck. This car is all right. This is literally the most fucking. It's, I, I really like how this car looks, especially like the rear end with those fucking exhausts just fucking pushing to the side. It's 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 lovely. It's lovely, honestly. Uh, so yeah, we have a Volga, a 2JZ Volga, KGB 2JZ Volga, man. This is beautiful communism, dude. This is communism at its peak, dude. Let's go and test it out. Give me a better place to test out this KGB machine than the Shutoku C1 Wangam in Japan. Uh, so we are on a highway in Japan to test out the, 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 the KGB machine. It's, it's a, a really nice to wheel spin, it seems. But it's definitely fast, 160. Yeah, we're just kind of spinning wheels at 160 kilometers. And the KGB machine, it is made to catch uh, bad people, bad Americans. It's made to catch the bad rush, the bad Western spies. This car is made to uh, catch every bad Western spy. Wow, that's fucking loud. Holy shit. Honestly, I should have made this this whole video in a, in, a, in a Russian in the Russian accent. That would have been amazing, wouldn't you agree? The Russian KGB machine. But then again, in the beginning, I really wasn't thinking about the KGB machine being what it is right now. But Shutaku man, we're going real fucking fast on the. This car is wholly unstable. It literally sounds like World War Two, man. Literally sounds like World War Two when I'm driving. When you hit something, this car. Holy shit! Yo, can we get an interior view? That's not interior. That's not interior. That's not interior. Okay, maybe we don't need interior view. We're just spinning, just spinning wheels. Look at it. Look at it. One wheel peels, man. Two hundred. Oh yeah, we can easily hit three hundred. Out, out on the Moscow Highway we go to just test the car out. You know, you never know when you will need to hit 300. And it does 300, no problem. It is a bit of damage to the car, but it's okay because Russian government will pay. I'm kidding, we will just extort some people. Hehe, <laughs> KGB, baby, blood. KGB! Oh, we don't have a wheel on the front. It doesn't matter. This car is way too fast to be pr pr t for that to be a problem. We're going 300. We're going, I'm going to hit like fucking mad speeds with three wheels, baby. Three wheeling this shit. Hell yeah, 160. Come on, I know you can do it more. I know you have it in yourself, baby. Come on, baby. Oh shit. I mean, honestly, these exploding sounds are amazing. Obviously, I'm fucking kidding, dude. Look at this. Oh, my God, dude. The KGB machine is amazing. But, yeah, guys. Thank you for watching uh, uh, this episode on the KGB Documentary History Channel. What's going on, everybody? It's the History Channel here. Um, <laughs> thank you for watching. And if you like this, uh, you know, uh, leave a comment saying you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye,